Hello friends, welcome to my channel Tech Tutorial. This is our HTML tutorial part 1 after introduction part. So today we are gonna learn about the basic structure of a web page by HTML coding. So let's get started guys. I'm gonna use notepad for writing HTML. But you can also use some similar apps like notepad++, bracket etc. So first open the notepad. Now, now, first we will put our opening tag that is HTML. Now we will put a close to it that is. Now, you can see here that that this opening tag consists with two things that is a less than and greater than sign and this closing tag consists with three things that is less than and greater than sign and a slash sign next we are going through the all parts which makes a html coding to make a web page next tag is our head tag head tag open then head tag close then our next tag is body like a human that body comes after head body close remember guys you must close the tags Now I am giving a title T I T L E in head title tag should be in head. I am giving a name, I am giving here a text like my. first web page my first web page then of next I am writing here another tag that is very important it is h1 tag sorry h1 tag and h1 tag close h1 tags it's a heading tag and there are six types of heading tags h1 h2 h3 h4 h5 and h6 i am writing here another text like this is my This is my page. Okay. Now we are going to save this. I am saving this file in my PC as let's save this as trial one trial one now listen to me guys carefully you have to put a extension that is HTML in every HTML file when you are saving this I am saving this in my desktop I have already created a folder that is my web page I am saving in this web my web page now let's check
here you can see this is my this is my page you can see the text which i have written in notepad has come here and this is written in h1 heading now i am going to show you i uh, now i am going to show you other heading tags Oh, I have already copied this you can see the h2 tag h3 h4 h5 and h6 again I am copying this control s control plus s now you can see the difference between the heading tags you can see the h1 tag is bigger than the left heading tags so that was the difference now I am now if you want to if you want to put this text in center you have to give another tag that is that is actually that's not a tag that's a attribute then you have to put double quotation and you have to put here center okay I am saving this again now you can see this text has come middle of this page this is my page now guys go back to notepad now I am showing you about I am now now I am showing you about pair tags and break tags I am copying this text again now I am putting here the pair tag the para tag is denoted with P para tag open and para tag close now you can see the difference this text is this text come to another para and this text is here now I am giving one more para then you can understand it clearly P open we close control R refresh here is now three lines which have made now I'm going back to notepad now what what is a break tag break tag breaks uh, breaks two lines like if I break tags br tag that's denoted with br now you can see this line has break into two lines now I am going back to the notepad again I am giving here another break tag now you can see the difference you will see the difference then then if you want to change background color of your page you have to you have to put up attribute in body tag that is background color in bg color 
बी जी कलर इक्वल्स टू इन बिटवीन डबल कोटेशन लाइक येलो कंट्रोल एस एस एफ कंट्रोल आर डी प्लेस नाउ यू कैन चेंज यू कैन सी द चेंज दैट द बैकग्राउंड कलर हैज चेंज इन टू येल्लो नाउ आई एम गोइंग बैक टू द नोट पैड नाउ इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चेंज द फॉन्ट ऑफ एनी टेक्स्ट यू हैव टू पुट अ न्यू टैग दैट इज फॉन्ट टैग and you can put some color you can change also the color of your text like font color if i choose red close font tag refreshing you can see the color of this text has changed now if you want to change the style of this text you have to put another like face face is equals to i'm taking some uh, tahoma saving this using control s control r refreshing you can see the font face has changed now you want to change the size of this text we have to write another attribute that is size is equals to twenty pixel you can put here any kind of pixel is the measurement of the size so i am putting here the twenty pixel you can say the size of this text has changed so for today only this practice is in your home and we will come again uh, with our next tutorial video html tutorial part 2 okay thank you friends please subscribe our channel take tutorial and share our videos okay thanks